that as well. Cool. Okay, cool. Let's do it. Yeah. All right. So who's to start? You? Yeah. Okay. Good next. Yep. In three, two, one. My name is Dr. Andrew Napier. I'm the founder and inventor of Intablade. My name is Dave Warden, and I am the co-founder and chief operating officer of Intablade. So back in 2008, I was deployed to Afghanistan as an army medic, and there was a soldier in my battalion that was killed by, by a, a vehicle-borne IED. Uh, it had detonated early as the soldier had stepped out of his vehicle to fire upon this, this rapidly approaching vehicle. Um, when this detonated and, and the shrapnel had gone off, it, it actually hit his face and actually went into his neck as well. Um, despite his heroic actions, this, this soldier had succumbed to his wounds into the battlefield. Uh, the medics had struggled to place a breathing tube, but they were unable to because uh, the amount of blood had covered the, the, the actual equipment they were using to place a breathing tube for the soldier. Um, I really thought about this uh, heavily when I was deployed. Uh, I started to mistrust sort of the, the, the equipment that was being issued to us. I started thinking and jotting things down, really thinking about what, what I could do to improve that. I worked on this for over a decade. I went to medical school, went through residency, uh, had a, a few prototypes along the way, and then found that idea, something that clicked, and that's how Enablate was born. So right now, we're in our final stages of development of the device. Uh, we're seeking a manufacturing partner. Uh, we have two issued patents and four currently pending. There's no product that's on the market that addresses the, the biggest concern with video laryngoscopy. And that biggest issue is the, the obstruction of the view for the, the user of this device. There's, there's nothing out there that addresses this whatsoever. Um, but we're, we're not having any competitors in that, in that environment. And we found a solution that's very easy, it's simple, it's cost effective, and it works. The biggest issue with this and why this is a problem is that when someone is using this laryngoscope, when they're going into someone's mouth and they're trying to place a breathing tube, if they get that view obstructed, they can't see anything. Uh, all the while, that patient goes without oxygenation. Now, that's a big issue because every second counts. Um, a time is brain. So you've got someone that's critically ill, critically injured, and they're not able to establish an airway, those people will suffer significant consequences. Those consequences of that, of not having a breathing tube placed, can be stroke, it can be brain death, it can be cardiac arrest. It's a multitude of things, and ultimately, they can succumb. To, to, to death. Well, if you force them blindly into an endotracheal tube into someone's mouth, um, you know, there's two pipes, and you got the trachea and you got the esophagus. So if you pass this blindly, you can go into someone's esophagus, and unfortunately, you know, I'm a board-certified emergency medicine physician. I see this all the time, and, and seeing from some of the medics that bring in patients into our emergency department. Um, that goes into the stomach, that insufflates the stomach, that provides no oxygenation to the lungs, and those people die. A lot of people will ask me a question about why should we switch over to use a different device? Why should we use Intablade? What, what's the significance with that? This is a simple to use device. We're not deviating from this well-beaten path of, of video laryngoscopy. Uh, there's no extra retraining that's required for this device. It's extra added functionality that's going to benefit the patient uh, at no additional training to the end user. Our device uses these micro tubular systems that sprays a very small amount of fluid onto the lens itself. Um, this is very easy to use. It's a push of a button. It sprays on uh, just like you would with your car. Um, if you think about if your car is covered, the windshield's covered, um, and you can't see through, there's mud, it's caked on, you click that button and it spray onto your windshield. Um, this does the same except without the need for windshield wipers. So we have the amount of, of, of force that goes behind the spray that clears off that lens completely. Sure. There is. So the lens is also coated in a hydrophobic coating and that allows the mucus or saliva or blood to come off the lens a little bit easier. We ran a non-clinical trial in 2021 testing our device against leading competitors. Uh, that study was published in the American Journal of Emergency Medicine and it proved 50% faster innovation times and a 100% first pass success rate. So the innovation process has changed in the era of COVID, and a lot of these things in the pre-hospital environment, a lot of institutions have put these policies in place that prevent EMS from performing uh, their jobs, their jobs of placing an airway. Uh, some of those airways can be a, a superglottic airway um, that sometimes can cannot go in the direction that it should. Sometimes these patients don't get oxygenated the way that they want. So we went through uh, that NSF i program, had spoken to numerous EMS personnel, and talked about, hey, what do you want? What was the thing that they would re you really want on a uh, device to make this as effective and as easy as possible. So outside of the, the spraying onto the lens, outside of the standard standardized geometry that requires no additional training, uh, we also had included a recording function that's very simple to use. It's right on the side of the, of the screen and that way they can confirm placement and to use that into their charts. All right. At Intablate, our mission is clear. We're going to revolutionize airways in the way that innovations are performed globally. 
At Innoblade, our mission is clear. We will revolutionize innovations and the way that they're performed on a global scale. Now that we have our freedom to operate in place, we've locked down our manufacturing partners, we've finished our design for manufacturing, all quality control for the FDA is in place, and we're cleared hot for market. Nice. Nice. Very good. Good job. Good for something. Oh, I even got <laughs>